And this is the New Zealand schedule um, from birth to 65. Okay, it's about, as you said, it's about 23 doses, including pregnancy, if we were going to count from birth till 65. Whereas the um, U.S. schedule has 72 doses on the childhood schedule, and depending on how you use the adult schedule, it goes something between like 20, 20 to 30 doses. Or it can, can you see me a link to that schedule? It's quite interesting. Hmm, what, what was that? Sorry, could you see me a link to that um, to that schedule? It's quite interesting. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Is it's it, on the CD. Yeah, I'd like to figure That's out why why there's so many. Is it are there more are there more vaccinations? Do they split the um, are they splitting combined vaccines into individuals? You like, can how count does it... the doses. Yeah, you can count the doses. It's on the just look up CDC U.S. childhood and adulthood vaccination schedules. The U.S. has the most aggressive vaccine schedule in the world. So based on um, just the schedules here alone, we can see that an average U.S. child, child in the U.S., would receive about the same amount of vaccinations in his first year of life as somebody in the entire life in New Zealand. So even if I was going by only half of the vaccine schedule in the U.S., I would be probably more vaccinated than you are. And yet, I am considered to be an anti-vaxxer, and you are a pro-vaxxer, so we can establish that anti-vaxxer, that label, serves no purpose other than to uh, put down people who criticize vaccine product information or policy.